Hello everyone and welcome back. It has been a hot minute. I think last time I recorded a video was about a year ago. It is the 24th of April and I literally just got back from Cambodia. I got back to my apartment an hour ago after a 24 hour flight. I thought I would start this vlog today just to give an insight on a typical day in my life. And um, today I'm gonna go shoot a campaign for this design collab I did with a Danish brand. And I actually already shot the campaign photos, but I shot it on a vintage camera, so the quality was not good enough for their page. My agent told me yesterday that the images hadn't been approved because of the quality, so I was like, oh, I need to find a new photographer in one day, so I was like stressing out. Luckily, I have gotten my friends to help me, so my good friend Lola and Jasmine are gonna come to my apartment. I just put on this mask that I bought in Singapore. My skin gets so dry when I travel, so I hope that this will keep my skin hydrated, even though I look fucking crazy. When I got home, there was a few packages, so let's unbox them together. This is the first one Woo! from Tom Ford, a perfume. Next package, look at this bag. This is like an art piece. Last package from Mason Magella. One of my favorite brands. It's a scented candle. I already have two of the candles in my room right now. My favorite smell is by the fireplace. But I'm really excited to try these. I'll take this off now because it's getting in my mouth. Oh, I can't believe I got back an hour ago and I have to get ready now to shoot. I just feel like I look so tired. Something that really helps me are these like energy patches that you put on your skin. And then it gives you energy so it's basically like... A coffee but it's just a patch because everything you put on your skin absorbs super quickly and it's helping a lot like this really gives me a lot of energy Hello. I just got back home from shooting with the girls it is currently 6.40 Fuck, how did this day go by so fast? I'm about to get in the shower I'm like so tired So I think for the rest of the day I'm just gonna sleep Good morning everyone It is currently 8.52 I just had someone from this vintage store Pick up my clothes And then they're selling it online I'm just gonna make a matcha And normally I would use coconut milk but they only had soya milk at my closest supermarket and I didn't want to walk that far so my plan for today is I'm going to the hairdresser in like an hour it's actually Friday today but I'm just like oof, I'm so tired I fell asleep yesterday at like 8 so I've slept 14 hours and I still feel tired like I think my body just really needs some rest mmm I love being alone and being in my own company but sometimes when I'm in periods where I'm with a lot of people all the time I really find it hard to get back into my routine of being alone and I just kind of want to be around people all the time that's probably also a reason why I just stay home to try and get a, my routine back and relax in my own company so I don't just go out to be around people I've been using these mushroom drops to make me feel more energized and I actually really like it. I feel like I'm trying all these new stuff to make me sustain my energy levels. Okay, I just got back from the hairdresser and why do I feel like my hair looks blue? Hopefully that will go away when I wash my hair, but like I have blue hair right now. Is it just me? I didn't get a cut because I feel like I kind of want to grow my hair out. I don't know. I feel like I'm so torn in between having short hair or long hair. I've had this for like a year now. And people keep telling me this is my hairstyle. Like you found your hairstyle. Da -da -da. But I just also miss having long hair. I'm about to go meet my friend Jasmine. We're going to get a matcha. Another matcha. Half a 
Camilla's friend. <laughs> jacket, which is so nice as well. You try it on. Should I try it on? Yeah, I feel like it looks sick on it. <laughs> Gorgeous. Like, should I also go get it? <laughs> Hit the flow. <laughs> oh, low, 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 low. <laughs> I just got back home. I did some grocery shopping. My newest obsession is these chips. I feel like I'm trying to convince myself that they're healthy because it's lentil chips. Oh, they're so good. I bought like a bunch of chickpeas to make my own hummus. Honestly, I still feel like I'm jet lagged. What question would you like to start with? But I don't know if I want this to be part of it. My mom was my manager for three years. With my mom before, I, I would get so annoyed with her because she's my mom. She'd be like, oh, mom, if this can wait, da, da, da. but when I signed with GIA, it's more like, okay, this is my job and I'm taking this very seriously, so I got much more motivated. Do you remind yourself that that is just a job? And, uh... Uh, I think sometimes I can think that my that me as a person is the same as my job on social media because it's obviously my name and my persona out there like i can have a a really shit day at work and things don't go the way i want them to but that doesn't mean that my life is shit and then and that everything is bad hold on let's not use yeah, shit, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you definitely be lonely a lot of the times because you go to all these events and all these things and you'll be around so many people 24 7 but then in the end when you get home to your hotel it's just you do you feel like you have friends in um here? Yeah, uh, like social media world. Mostly all of my friends are in the social media world. It's nice to have friends in the same industry. I get inspired by my friends and we can help each other. But I also have my, my friends from back home. I think that's very important. But it can also be difficult to stay in contact with all of my old friends. I just got back from getting my nails done. It was these with a natural color and then just some like small detail prints and I think they're pretty cute. I'm having some friends over tonight before our dinner and I wanted to buy some Aperol to make for us at home. So I go to the first supermarket and then they ask for ID and I have my ID on my phone because in Denmark we have like this app where you can just have your ID on your phone so you don't need to carry your passport or your driver's license around. And she's like, no, we need the physical ID. So I'm like, oh my god, go to the next supermarket. The same. They're like, no, we need the physical ID. Like, I'm walking home, like, oh, this is so annoying because then I have to go get my passport. But then I remember there's this shop, like, right next to me where they usually always ask for ID, but I've been there so many times now. So I thought, okay, maybe they'll let me buy it. So I walk into the store, and then there's a guy standing behind the desk. And I just say, yes, the first thing, I'm like, do you remember me? I think he got all nervous because he didn't remember me. I meant it obviously in a way so as like I've bought stuff there before so if you remember that I'm old enough. He's getting all nervous and he's like, oh you know. I'm like, oh yeah, I come here all the time. I think he thought I was flirting with him. Didn't even ask for my ID. Well, I'm just happy I got to buy my uproll. I'm gonna jump in the shower and work for a bit. completely forgot to vlog after my girls night out yesterday i was literally just like dying in bed and packing because i had to catch a flight this morning to copenhagen and i just got it it's very exciting i'm hosting an event tomorrow i am the ambassador of weisel beauty in denmark it's so warm in copenhagen it's crazy in london it was so cold and rainy so i'm literally wearing like a full knit and this huge jacket i'm gonna actually just take this jacket off right now because i'm dying this is my cute little room and they left me a little note and some chocolate. Definitely overpacked. I packed all of these shoes because I don't know, I feel like you just, you never know what you're going to need. So I got a little something for everything. But I actually, I only brought these two bags and this one is a lot. So this is basically the only bag I have for this week. Oh well. And I have my travel bag which I love. It fits everything. What's it, the gym? It's from here with. Best gym. <laughs> it feels like summer. It is summer. In here. It is like summer. It's almost, it's it's almost May. It's almost May. 16, 17, 18 degrees. 
Yay! It's our first time catching up since Coachella. Was this only like two weeks ago? I'm gonna wear this black shirt tomorrow and Sebastian is helping me steaming it. But I mean, this so is quite like easy. Twice, <laughs> Thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Ciao. Ciao.